Union Home Minister Rajnath Singh, who is currently on a four-day visit to Jammu and Kashmir, said he has ordered four bulletproof vehicles at police stations in the state. In an interaction with Jammu and Kashmir police and CRPF personnel in Anantnag, district of Kashmir, Singh said, Orders have been issued for bulletproof vehicles at all police stations in Jammu and Kashmir. He further added, Our Jawans should also get bulletproof jackets and fund for these has been released. The All India Muslim Personal Law Board is considering a review petition against the Supreme Court verdict that banned the practice of instant triple talaq as unconstitutional. AIMPLB, which held an executive meeting in Bhopal on Sunday to chalk its future course of action, has maintained that August 22nd ruling goes out against Sharia. The board also cited crime records and domestic violence and stated that communities which do not have a quick form of divorce often witness a higher number of suicide and domestic violence. The United Left Alliance has retained all four seats in the Jawaharlal Nehru University Students' Union election, defeating the RSS-backed ABVP by considerable margins. In the central panel, a total of 1,512 nota votes were polled out for all four posts. A total of 31 councillors have been elected for various posts, the election officials said. Two people killed and ten others were left injured after a portion of a flyover collapsed in Bomikal in Bhubaneswar, district of Odisha on Sunday. As per the latest reports, five persons were believed to be trapped under the debris. Rescue operations took out a full swing to check out the crisis.